One mom described her newly adopted daughter today as her extra heartbeat. It was my privilege to be in Judge Ralph Winkler's courtroom for Back to School Adoption Day. Talk about the ultimate act of kindness, giving a child a forever home. Do each of you solemnly swear that the testimony you will give today will be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth to help you guys? That was perhaps the most serious moment on this otherwise joyful morning in Judge Ralph Winkler's courtroom. We watched as 10 children got their forever families on back to school adoption day. The idea being they start the new school year, backpacks and all, with their new names. Let's just say tears flowed. Smile, boys. Smiles stretched ear to ear, and sentiments were priceless. She's my extra heartbeat. Each family came with a special story. We met three. Isaiah Robert Kale. What day is it today? Adoption day. Maybe little, but he knows special when he sees it. Mom Suzanne was adopted herself as a child. She paid it forward a second time today. It is definitely one of the happiest days, this day and the way, day we got her. With her wife Ashley, who was so happy too. Oh, just because he just officially feels like ours. Relief and joy across the board for everyone who grew their broods. Aiden's adoption makes 10 kids in the Weber clan. The judge joked about the more mature parents. I like to help the kids. Um, with our ages, we're getting a little older now and just might not be able to do it, but we'll, we're going to try. <laughs> what are your ages? Do you mind? Uh, 47 and 60. 47? Well, 60. <laughs> 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 45. From the Webbers to the Kelseys, Tony is 18 and celebrated finding her forever family. Her keepsake teddy bear's paw marks the day and the end of a journey. The woman who calls herself Tony's extra mom fostered her until she went back to her family. Then I heard through social media that she was back in care in 2015 and I called the agency looking for her and I got her back. Thank you for being here in my life. I won't be here without you. Oh, that's one of those heart grabbing moments. A lot of love to end your week. So happy for all of those families. And that is WCPO 9 News at 7 this Friday night. You can find us anytime on your favorite streaming apps. The list is next. Have a good weekend. And as always, be safe, be well.